Hey everybody, it's Matt Shares. I'm gonna to talk to you about purchase segmentation. So if you think about the term account segmentation, I would equate that with 1991. Just saying that you have a list of accounts and you have some element around segmentation of the mid-market is not enough. You need to solve for purchase intent. So think about this as a propensity to buy model. So if I'm ahead of sales or ahead of marketing, I need to know by an order of magnitude, five critical elements in purchase segmentation. Number one, cost of acquisition by product line, market segment, and sales channel. What is it cost to go get a new customer? Lifetime value. How long do they stay and what do they extract? And make sure I have my ratio of CAC and LTV by product line, market segment, and sales channel. Next thing I need to know is match to ideal customer profile. How do I do that? A frontier analysis. What are the top 20% of my customers? What do they look like, right? Firmographics, industry, decision maker, trigger event. The last two, propensity. I might have a lot of potential to buy, but if I don't have propensity to spend, because I'm in a contract with the bad guys, don't deploy selling capacity at that asset. Those are the big five in purchase segmentation. If you're looking to learn more, there's a detailed breakdown in the SBI, How to Make Your Number Workbook. You can download a purchase segmentation model Benchmark yourself and see how you're doing. As always, I wish you good luck as you try and make your number.